<laughs> Don't do it, think of your health! <laughs> That's so nice. Oh god. Yeah. Trust me, I can spot girls up. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Gotta do the English clap first. Yeah, that's it, and the old this. <laughs> yeah. Hello everybody and welcome to episode four of the great mega um Mega Mark Box. Mega Mark Box. That's yeah, it. We mega like that. Box. Mega Mark Box. Um, as you can see, we are not in our livery today because it is summer in England and we're absolutely boiling. We English people don't deal with heat too no, well. Well, we good. don't. We don't deal with no, heat. No, some people love heat. Me and Kev are like, no, please, you're better than I am. I am, yeah. But like 20 degrees and I'm dead. I'm Exa done. Yeah, exactly that. Look at me, I'm red. I've been, I went out in the sun to let my dog out and what's, I've got sun tan already. What's 20 degrees in Fahrenheit? <laughs> we're like, uh, 20 late. degrees is 70. That high? Yeah. That sounds high. No, that's where it is. Is it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, it's like 70 degrees here. Anyway, we digress. Yeah, we digress. We or are the group in the court. <laughs> or in the court. I'm Kevin. I'm Tash. My four vampiric daughter. I mean, as you can see from the last video. I'm looking we've gone, different. We've gone full on. I've gone full, full on, on vampire. Mode, yeah. yeah. Full on vampire now. Yeah. She want to drink my blood. I do, blah, 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 blah. You can't do it, can you? No. Yeah. But you know that um, that kids movie, Hotel Transylvania? Yeah. They always go, um, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> close enough. <laughs> it's close enough. It's close enough. <laughs> so, what we're doing today is another selection of goodies from Mark's box that he sent us. Mm -hmm. Thank you again, Mark. And we're going to kick, the, kick it off with... We're kicking it off. Squirty cheese! Because Mark knows, Mark knows this is my most favourite thing in the world. This is a superfood. I don't care what anybody says, this is a superfood. This is Kev's favourite thing. It now. completely is. Yeah. It completely is. And now, when we got the box, because there's so much stuff in there, we didn't see this. And Mark sent us some of things which we tried in an earlier episode. Cheeky crackers. And I said to Tasha, well, this would be great with squeezy, squeezy cheese. And lo and behold, Squeezy cheese. And he left us a note saying to put cheese on said crackers. And we didn't see the notes on the box. No, no, we didn't. Because the bottom of the box. The it? box was so huge and full, mm. crammed full of stuff. So, we have... Do you remember how to use this contraption? I do know, yeah. <laughs> You're a pro now, aren't I you? Am, yeah. Yeah. We have chicken in chicken a biscuit. Chicken in a biscuit. And we have squirty cheese. I'm going show to the camera, show the camera. Show the camera, show get the camera. That, get that action get, in there. Oh, 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 oh look, okay. you are a pro now. That took look you a that. second. Look at that. Beautiful. Mm. Ah. Ah. <laughs> Angelic music mm. plays. Mm. Ah. Are you going to have a squirt? Of the, of the cheese. This one's American. What was the last one we had? Cheddar or something. It was cheddar, yeah. Oh, that's delicious, man. Look at that. If you are in America and you haven't tried this because you think it's gross, just, just try it. Because when we first got it, we were like, Ooh. What on earth? Yeah, and I put on our Instagram account, which is the Grabologist, by the way. I put on there, like, mm, not really look forward to trying this one. But really, we like it. There's only one thing to do with this. Oh. That's gross. <laughs> Oh, that's like proper nacho cheese. It's fantastic. Isn't it? That's like when you get na nachos at the cinema and you get that mm. gross pot of that um, liquid cheese. Yeah. It tastes exactly the same. And do you know what's best about this? Mm. It never goes off. Ever. It doesn't go off. I don't understand. You'd have to refrigerate it and then it goes off. date on it or No. Anything? It's like, and like I said. This is a source of calcium. It's health food. It's healthy. It's healthy. It's health food. <laughs> mm. We all need calcium. Keep those bones strong and healthy. I don't need to mark that. Because I'm going to mark that one million. A million a out million. of a million. And combined with these, oh look, I didn't see that serving suggestion on the back. Easy cheese. With Which flavour does it say to do? Cheddar. It's just cheddar. Yeah, it says cheddar. No, I'm going for American. Oh, you should have really should have gone for it and drawn pictures like they did. I am not. We could have done arts, food, arts and crafts. They're round anyway, so you can't do that. Not a round, round. You could have done a square version. No. Get no. fancy with it. No, I can't do that. Was it good? Fanta unbelievable. Was it everything you hoped it would be? Who knew that chicken and cheese was a thing? Every American ever probably. Every American but We don't do chicken and cheese here. We don't do, do chicken and cheese, no. No, not at all. No, never. Not even in McDonald's. No. 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 Yeah, that's interesting. Yeah. But chicken and cheese is a thing. Mm. One million out of ten. Chicken and cheese. There you go. There we go. 
And I can do one million out of ten because that fellow Simon Cowell, when he's giving people marks out of ten, he gives one million percent, doesn't, doesn't he? he? One million percent. We know that that's not possible, but if he can do it, so can I. It's a British thing. Really. You ain't no Simon Cowell. <laughs> well. <laughs> He's a few pounds in front of me, I think. <laughs> you don't get more English than Simon Cowell, do you? Yeah, me! There you go. No, okay. Right, so the next He's a national treasure. <laughs> He's a national something, but I'm not going to say anything. Shut it! Right. These look good. They do. Reese's Snack Cake. Mm. I'm not Is quite sure. Chocolate? Of course, it's Reese's. Reese's and peanut butter. Reese's, yeah. yeah. Peanut butter and chocolate. Oh, the taste of that's still in my mouth. What the cheese? cheese. Fantastic. You just oh. sniff back your hand and it cleanses your, <laughs> your palate. I don't want to. You're want, fresh. I want to linger. The memory to linger. Well, this looks good. This looks like a, I was expecting a cake. This looks like a chocolate bar. It does, doesn't okay. it? Look at that. Oh, it's yeah. melting already. It is melty, isn't it? I told you it's warm here. Wow. Ready? Yeah. Mm. That's really good. Mm. Mm. That is, really oh, that is really good. It's not like a cake though. No. It's just cake. This to me is like a chocolate bar, but I don't know what that is, but it's kind of like a brownish texture. It, it is, yeah. It's a bit, it's a lot more solid. I just want a bit of that to see what it is. But it's hard to get that. That is though. delicious. Mm. That is really delicious. The peanut flavour is not overpowering at all. I can't tell what this is, but it is like brownie ish. Does it say on there that it's brownie ish? Mm. It's really nice, whatever it is. Well, this, this is an easy, easy nine. Mm. That's one of my favourite Reese's things. Yeah, I'm going to say that as well. Mm, it is. It's good. Because sometimes, even though they're delicious, sometimes the peanut and sugar Too can much. be a bit overwhelming. Yeah. Even though it tastes delicious, you think, oh, I can't finish that. This is dangerous because I could easily do a packet of that. There's two sticks in a, a pack. Mm -hmm. I could easily do a whole packet of that, could you? It's good. Yeah. I might get like one and a half done and then I think I might feel a bit sick. <laughs> but... Eating a whole a whole one in itself. Yeah. Usually we can't do that with Reese's stuff. No, we can't. We have oh. like one of the mini peanut butter cups, and we've done like we're like, oh, that's so rich. Um, but yeah, I could eat a whole one of those things. That mm. is tremendous. Nine. Yeah. You, milady, you're getting English. Being I'm, English. A, I'm gonna give it a ten. You giving it a ten? I'm gonna give it a ten. Wow. Yep. By it's the, a ten. By the way. Tash didn't try the uh, chicken in a biscuit because they contain real chicken. Real chicken? Real chicken. We don't do that in England. No, we always put fake stuff in. Yeah. Yeah. Vegetarian, so she's not she's not tried those. Yeah, but I had a really nice comment the other day Go on. that was someone was like, why do people get so angry if she doesn't try one thing? It's it's one thing. And I was exactly. like, thank exactly you. Exactly that. Exactly that. I don't want to try one thing. Because I can assure you, if Tash brings any more vegan stuff to the table, this meat eater is not trying it because that is minging. I want great. Minging. The, I mean, the sweets were good, but the chocolate yeah. was so oh, bad. But I've had good, good chocolate since then. I don't I'm not that. vegan, I'm vegetarian, so I do eat cheese and stuff. Um, but yeah, we tried vegan things ages did. ago, didn't we? Long time the chocolate ago. was. Yeah. That was really I threw it all away. And I'm they were expensive. I'm not surprised. Well, everything is, isn't it? But the yeah. Cadbury's vegan one is good. I don't believe you. It's good. I don't believe you. It's good. You know, I'm, I'm gonna get some. I don't believe you. I don't believe that. Oh, Lynn's my favourite. Oh. Do you want to know something really awful? Go on. I bought a box of lint when I was in Scotland and I ate the whole thing to myself in two days. I only gave Fred one. The whole thing in two days. It's my favourite. Do you know what? I, I just can't not because they're just so perfect. I think that says a lot about her really, doesn't it? Her starving child and she didn't give him one lint chocolate. Starving? Chapter. Yeah, he's clearly not. He's really He mad. had a lot of other snacks, but I just reserved those for me. Like, you know, like, you can have How one. old is he? Six. Six and he's six foot two. Unbelievable, this kid. He's <laughs> massive. Six foot two, yeah. He is built like He's huge. He's yeah. Six and he's wearing ten year old's clothes. Bizarre. Ten, eleven year old 11. clothes now. He's got no, the whole size. I, sorry, he's not wearing clothes that are 11 years old. He's wearing clothes that are New clothes that are sized 11. for an 11 year old. Yeah, and he's six. We're microbiologists, not childologists. I know he is, he's getting on. Yeah. So are you? But he eats a lot. <laughs> Did you say I was getting on? I didn't say anything. Mm. 
<laughs> no comment, because if I comment about your age, you'll cry. Yeah, well, you get my age bloody wrong, don't you? You put 10 years on it. Yeah, I always assume he's like, what, late, late 60s? 68, she said I was. 68. I'm not good with dates. You gave me the date. Not, not, the, not the number. And 68. I was like, what's that then? Yeah. At 10 years. Ka! Ka! Is what I said. Ka! Anyway, I won't let her let. We're playing She's never, never going to live that down. So, Lint, Lindor, Lindor. I love now this. So much. We don't have this flavour. We don't get this flavour, no, do we? Don't, no. Because this is very much an American flavour. We have full on Lint shops and we still don't have this flavour. No, because it's tailored to America. I mean, blueberries and cream. I mean, is that, yeah, that's never... really American. And don't say as American as apple pie, because apple pie was invented in Yorkshire. Was Just it? Same, yeah. Wow. Bramley. Bramley. Oh yeah, Bramley apple pies. Did they invent apple pies as a concept though? No, apple pie was invented here. It, it was in, in olden days, in, in, in olden days. Henry Tudor's days. To be fair, days. apples are one of the only fruits we have in this country. It's one of the only fruits we've got. <laughs> in um, Henry Tudor days, everybody ate pies. Right. And so, they had it right. They had it as a they had it they right. costed, yeah. pie is everything. We are still here. Do you know what one of my favourite desserts is? Pie. No. Or pie with custard. Apple crumble. Oh, Where's crumble. that from? Because that's so good. I apple crumble with custard. I don't know where apple crumble comes from. Oh, yummy. I'll have that's to one find of my favourites though. I'll have to do some grubology investigation and find out. Look how cute. This is a yeah. nice colour. Look at that. It is, isn't it? Very nice. Mm. I tried one of the strawberries and um, cream ones with these. Like at Christmas time. Yeah. That was really good. Oh, weird. Now I'm going to say, weird. oh, it's white it's not, chocolate. Why isn't it perfectly smooth? I don't know. Oh, it's like it's been wrapped. How is it really smooth? Do you think, oh, I know. Do you think it's melted and it's formed to the packet? Yeah, definitely, yeah. yeah. So I think it was originally round. Now I'm not big on Lindor stuff. Just, Liz gets it, them all the time. Like, that does smell like blueberries. Oh, it does smell like blueberries. Mm. Okay. You're not, you're not. No, I'm not big on them. Uh, Liz gets them at Christmas and I sort of don't bother with them. But, oh. So. Weird. <laughs> I love them. Oh. Oh, that's really good. Look, the inside's purple. It's blueberries. I know, but I wasn't expecting it to be that colour. Mm. What colour do you expect blueberries to be? I don't know. Blue. <laughs> purple. Mmm. Mmm, that's good. That's so good. It's yogurt, is it? Yogurt? It seems it seems like it, yeah. It's really nice mm. flavoured um, chocolate. Yeah. Is it chocolate or yogurt? I'm sure it's yogurt, no? Cream. What is well, it? I think what are you? No, yeah, chocolate, truffles, white chocolate. It tastes creamy though, do you not think? Like yogurt, it tastes like yogurt. It does, it tastes like yogurt. Is it yogurt or, yo or yogurt? Yogurt. Yogurt. We, we're from I, I'm so confused, I don't know. I was like, I'm saying both. <laughs> we're, from, we're, from, we're from Yorkshire, so it's yogurt. I can never remember which one I use. <laughs> yogurt. It's yogurt. Yogurt. Yeah. Those are nice though. They are really nice. They Let's are. Give those to Liz. Okay. Because I'll eat the whole packet. Okay. Liz will, you know, be good with it. <laughs> they are absolutely delicious. And I'm going to say to you that had my wife bought these at Christmas, yeah. I would have tried them mm -hmm. because they're really nice. I'm giving them a nine. Those ones are my favourite. The original red packet. Oh yeah, that's they're, they're the ones she gets, those three. Yeah. I love them. Yeah, they're really good. Yeah. Yeah. Scott. Well, you found something that you like. I know. I'd give them a nine. Because the red packet is a, a ten. Delicious. 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 If those come on sale in England, I swear that they will fly out. I, yeah, they would. They would, yeah. I, I love the packaging on that one. Now. I've been eyeballing these mm. because we both love they got, coffee. Well, they got the fun and I'm going to let you open it. We both love coffee, and for some bizarre reason in the UK, it's very little things that are coffee flavoured. I think I've only ever found one biscuit which is coffee flavoured, and I can't find it anymore, but it did exist at one point. Yeah, we don't get any fun things with no, coffee flavour. Nothing. Oreo coffee. It does look good though, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Go on, madam, do the pulley open your thing. Look how fun. I want packaging like this here. Look at that. It's a... It came off way better in my head. Right, let me just snap these <laughs> weird little bits. Ready? Look, Look at, that. at that. How what genius is that, though? Know. Look how many you get in a packet. Oh, smell it. <gasps> oh. That smells so good, doesn't it? It does, yeah. Yeah, why don't we get good packaging I like that? I don't know why we don't get good packaging. So that... These smell unbelievable. Let us know in the comments if you can get these all the time. Java chip 
Yep, so it's, it's pure, it's just coffee flavoured cream. Is it a special flavour or is this like all the time you can get these? You see, why don't we get this? Because it's, we get Oreos and it's Nabisco. We should get, we should get these. Yeah, we, we, get, we get very few flavours of Oreos here though. Right. Around like Christmas and stuff, we'll get a few extra flavours, mm. like vanilla or whatever, we'll yeah. get extras. But throughout the year, it's just plain old regular ones. Well, these these are, um, oh they smell fantastic. Are we yeah, going in for it? Yeah, yeah. That's so nice. Oh, God. That is so good. That is really good. Isn't it really good? <laughs> That's so nice. Even the biscuit tastes better in this, don't you think? Well, chocolate, coffee and mm. chocolate are just... Yeah, wow, that's that, spot on. That's a 10. Yeah, that's a 10. That's really good. I'm so jealous that you get these in, in America. I know, me too. Me too. I can't believe we don't get these. I think we should start a petition. Let's do one of those... Um, is it called a petition? People have to sign it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's start one of them. We want coffee Oreos. <laughs> it get a lot more signatures than you think. But you know, I don't understand. I mean, mm. over recent years, probably over the last twenty years, the amount of coffee drunk in the UK is probably on on a par with America. Really, I think everybody. We've got coffee shops everywhere, like you have in the states. We have, you have. Um, we won't Starbucks. have as many, but yeah, we well, do. Really, a lot you have now. Starbucks. But we've got coffee shops. A brand called Costa. And uh, Costa coffee cost a lot. And what's the other one? Cafe Nero. Cafe Nero, yeah. And we do have Starbucks as well. But like you have Starbucks on every corner. We've got Costas on every, every two everywhere. Miles. Every every garage that you go to, every sorry I mean, petrol station yeah. that you go to, Costa machine. Yeah, a machine. But I mean, like an actual coffee shop. Like we don't have like that many drive throughs like they do. I think they have a lot of drive throughs uh, Well, the drive throughs are quite a new thing here, but an actual shop on the high street or in the town, oh, yeah, there's they're always, everywhere. Yeah, there's they're always everywhere. at least a Costa in every single town. Mm. A lot of towns will do um, Nero and Starbucks as well. Like in our little town, ours is tiny, but we have all three. And they're right next to each other, aren't they? Yeah, they are. Right next to each other. We don't have the Starbucks. No, we don't. We've just got Nero yeah, and Costa. Uh, yeah, Nero Costa. and Costa, but um, I don't like Starbucks. And then you've got the profusion. We must have, in our little town, we must have at least 10. At least 10. Cafes. Artisan co coffee shops. Definitely, yeah. At least 10. We've got a lot. Our town consists of charity shops, which I love, um, cafes see, and hairdressers. See Tashi's other channel, there will be a, a, a thing in the link. Oh yeah, I'll link it down below. I just hit 1,000. Hey, I'm on 1,060. Wow, I got great. 60 in like the last few days. That's fantastic. That's good, isn't it? It's really good. But I do uh, thrifting and charity shop videos, so we'll link that down below. But um, yeah, so our town is literally charity shops, cafes, and hairdressers. Pretty much, <laughs> isn't yeah. it? And, 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 and karma, and karma. Shop. That's yeah. By yeah. <laughs> far the best. Shop that's now. probably why we do so well because there's no other shop to go to. Everybody's bought a coffee. Yeah, <laughs> probably. It's like the only, like um, karma's like the only shop you can really look around and like look at stuff. Yeah, isn't it? it that is. new stuff. Yeah. It is. Yeah, pretty much. But that, that was a massive tangent. But love. Love, love, See the love. rant we got on after coffee. I know. We could just talk about. Let's just do a, co a coffee podcast. Oh, I'd love to do <laughs> just that. Just talk about our love of coffee. No, no, I'd love to do that because because the thing is, I've got. We could try a different coffee every episode. We could try a different coffee every episode. I could do that. Definitely. I could really do that. Coffee artisans. Yeah. Artisan coffees. I could definitely do that because I've got a real problem with people. I'm real, real it's a coffee, coffee snob. snob. I'm a proper coffee snob. I'll drink anything. No. He's a coffee snob. No. It ha he's so fussy. If he comes to my house to film, if we do it at my house, he won't have a coffee because no. he doesn't like my options. No. Even though one of my coffee machines you gave me. But he got rid of it because it wasn't good enough. Exactly. <laughs> I've got two coffee machines and you're not like you, No, I don't know. No. No. <laughs> snob. Yeah, I am. I admit it. I am a snob. Coffee snob. Coffee is the only... Look, I don't drink and I don't smoke, but I do partake in many coffees. This is true. And it has to be certain coffee Made in a certain way. Do you know what? I've just seen something and I'm a bit grossed out. Come. Vanilla cupcake goldfish. Let's have them next. I've just, I've just clocked clocked it then, and I always assumed that they would be a, a savoury. Well, we've only had cheese. I know, but do you think that they're like the same thing but sweet? Yeah. I don't know. I feel like we've only had. I cheese literally before. just saw it and I was like, it completely blanked my mind, and I was like, what? <laughs> 
So this is this is going to be something. This is vanilla cupcake flavored goldfish. Now we've I don't only like ever seen American vanilla flavored stuff. It's well, too much. I don't know. We'll have to try. it. We've only ever had these via Mark, cheesy flavored. Yeah, and they were so good. They were brilliant. Yeah, but we've had two different types of them. Yeah, two different types of cheese ones: white cheese and regular. And regular, ch an extra mature cheddar yeah. or something, wasn't it? I don't smell. It doesn't smell overly vanilla, eh? No, it doesn't. It might be okay. I just, I have flashbacks of that vanilla Hershey's, I think, and it was just oh. all kinds of wrong. Yeah. yeah that was it was wrong. a birthday cake. It was just so yeah. vanilla. -y. Okay. They seem okay. like normal. Yeah. No, it's actually really good. Do you? Yeah. Not for me. Because they taste exactly like these German biscuits I grew up on. Right. Exactly like them. Like, it's the same thing. I can't remember what they're called. For, for me, the texture's not correct for the taste, if you know what but I mean. But these are more biscuity than the regular ones. The, the regular ones are more like crisp type. I don't know. Things. These are more like biscuits. Now, I don't know whether it's my, my brain playing tricks with me because You're I'm expecting, expecting it to be cheese. cheesy. But they, they remind me so much of this German childhood snack. I can't remember what they were called, but exact same taste. Um, I like them. I give them like an eight. They're not. They're not terrible. No, I, give, I give them a six. To say how scared I was to try that thing, because yeah. I, I thought I thought it'd be cheese, but with the yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like che I thought it'd be like a cheese, vanilla. yeah, with vanilla, and I was like, that's really weird. Yeah, that but no, weird. they're taking the cheese away. And yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. But those seem more biscuity to me. Those seem more biscuity than than crispy. They're a grower actually. Now I've been rolling them around a little bit. They're pretty good. They are quite nice, mm. although. Sweet. I prefer the cheesy ones of these, I've got to say. But we are quite, we do like the same. We do, but yeah. look at the amount of sweet things. We also like sweet things. I mean, that. yeah, but if you had to live off sweet stuff forever or savoury stuff forever, which one would you choose? Oh. You're only allowed sweet or savoury, you can't have both. Which yeah. one? I've got to eat savoury, but only only because you can eat more. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. We can, can't you? I mean, come on. The Oreo Java chip biscuits, even though I love them, you could <gasps> probably only do 10. Two of them is 140 calories. Two? Two of them. So that means one of them is like, do the maths. No, uh, 70. 70 calories. For one little biscuit? That's depressing. Yeah. I'd still eat them. <laughs> <laughs> Same here. Same here. <laughs> that won't stop me. And this is the reason why we would prefer savoury if we were yes. given the choice of only living off sweet or savoury. Yeah, savoury. It's got to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because coffee is technically savoury, so. Good point. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it is coffee savoury. Yeah. Honest. It is. <laughs> it is. We don't put sugar in it. No, we don't. It's a fact. It's savoury. <clears throat> Just saying, merch is available. <laughs> no. We don't actually have it like up for sale on a site or anything, but I suppose we could. We could do. Yeah, yeah. we could do. But we're just dabbling right now, aren't we? We're we dabbling. Are. We keep buying ourselves Grabology <laughs> merch because we're losers like that. <laughs> we are losers like that, yeah. We are completely. Right. These, these look nice. These look posh. These look posh. These Anything look posh. in... Oh. 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 Ah. 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 Now then, we're going to say... <laughs> crisps with chocolate. But, as you know, our favourite brand of crisps... Hers. Uh, Hers crisp with chocolate. Now we're going to say... Which means it's going to have to be good. But well, we're going to say that everything that hers do is fantastic. It's crisps. it's crisps. I thought it was biscuits. So did I, but it's crisps. Oh, it is. Potato it and is. chocolate. I bet it's really good. How do you open it? Though? I don't know. Yeah. I bet it's really good. Oh. Oh, look at that. That looks like it was like really on there. Oh. Wowzers. Yeah, I'm going to say... That looks a lot better than that. <laughs> but let's try. I can't believe that's the crisp. Do you think it's like a salted crisp or just like it a plain potato? Well, no, but, but if you think about it, they do have salted chocolate, don't they? So that, that would good. work. Yeah. yeah. All right, then. Interesting. The smell's not, oh. not brilliant. Oh, oh, oh. The smell is weird. Oh, no, it smells like Play-Doh. Smell the actual crisp. Yeah, Why does it smell like I don't know, that's weird. Mm. Come on. Mm, <coughs> Here we go. Oh, I better show them first. There you go, see? It smells like Play-Doh, though. Chocolate-coated. 
it looks good to me. This looks good. Like the chocolate and stuff, but it smells. It looks a bit scary to me, if I'm honest. <laughs> yeah. Ready? Yeah. Okay. No. No. That's disgusting. Oh. oh, hell, what are you doing? That's horrible. Oh. No, and the chocolate's bad. Yeah. The chocolate is bad. The, the, the crisp has gone soggy. It says it's Swiss chocolate, though. But that's not good. It says Oxo and Buses, but you wouldn't put one down in your dinner, would you? That. It says what? Oxo and Buses. <laughs> it does <laughs> <laughs> that's horrible. Don't buy those. Tastes like Play-Doh. It actually tastes like Play-Doh too. Yeah. It smells I'm, like Play-Doh and tastes like Play-Doh. I'm going to say that concept is not a winner for me. Mm -mm. The crisps have gone soggy. There's, they are soggy. There's yeah, horrible, they're soggy. soggy. And the chocolate's horrible. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to give that nothing. No, that was horrible. Not... Zero. You couldn't pay me for one. No. Nil point. Oh. horrible. I've just seen Ooh. these. Another. More Lindo. Lindo. Look how pretty their colours are. That's so pretty. It is, isn't it? Yeah. I'm a bug. <laughs> that is pretty. So this is Neapolitan flavour. <gasps> is that ice cream? Is Neapolitan ice cream? Neapol well, yeah, I suppose it is, yeah. Is that like the three flavours? Yeah. That looks really, really nice. So this should be, this should have the, the taste of strawberry, chocolate and vanilla. Mm. That's going to be hard. That's going to be hard, surely, to get three flavours in a sweet. All the interesting flavours, we don't get stuff like this. Here you go. It's so pretty. Oh, smell. I can smell through the packet. Oh, look, it's got chocolate bits in it. I like that. That's got that, you know that really fake strawberry flavour? Yeah, it does, yeah. Yeah, it really does. Really? And not yet, I've got to get this, and I've got to do my usual for oldens, for all you old English people out there, if you remember a pink panther bar, that's what it smells like. It smells good. It smells like strawberry ice cream to me. Okay. Mm -hmm. That tastes exactly like Neapolitan ice cream. It really does. Yeah, it does. Like that fake strawberry flavour. Fantastic. Mm. Oh! Just got it then. McDonald's strawberry milkshake. Spot on. That's what it is, isn't it? Yeah, spot on. That's a great flavour that. Mm -hmm. Very sweet though, you couldn't eat many no. of them. They're stopped, you yeah. really couldn't eat many of them. They're really good. But then again, the lint is like, the next to Cadbury's is like my favourite chocolate. So of course I was going to like it. See? But it tastes exactly like the milkshake. It, really it does, does, it really does. Yeah. They could only better that if they did a banana flavoured one. I love that banana flavoured ice. That would be really nice, yeah. Excellent, nine. Nine. So, next up we've got oh, Werther's. So now, we do get Werther's here, but this is oh. caramel apple filled. Oh, he was actually green inside, don't I? Yeah. You think now, so? I'm not going to try one of these because I know what you yanks are like with uh, cinnamon. So I'm gonna let I'm gonna let Tash try one of these, and if she tells me there's no, I should probably tell me there's no cinnamon. I in wouldn't this. do that to you. It says creamy apple flavour, so it doesn't say cinnamon. Yeah, but they like cinnamon on everything. They don't do, they, yeah. So. But it's gonna take me ages to get through one of these. Crunch it. My teeth are crunchy. Meanwhile, I will enjoy coffee wow, from uh, the Gravologist mug. Oh, okay. It has a greenish tinge to it. Do you not think? Or is that just me playing tricks? No, no, it does have a greenish tinge. Okay. <laughs> She's got teeth made of milk. No, there's no cinnamon. No cinnamon, we're in, we're in. They are so good. Do you know what they taste like? Like, Ooh. you know when you get Halloween candy mm -hmm. and it's an apple flavour? Mm. Mm -hmm. They're really nice. They are, they are so much better than the plain Whirlers. Mmm. Nice. I like those. I'm going to give those like a nine. That is good. Are they sugar free as well? I don't know. How would you know that? Oh, that's delicious. No, I don't think, I'm sure they've got sugar in it. It's caramel or whatever that is, isn't it? Mmm. 
But I thought Werther's were sugar free, or is that just some Werther's that are sugar free? I think it's just some, I'll check though. 50 calories per serving. Well, that serving. can't be sugar free then, can it? That's delicious. That's two pieces. So 25 calories per piece. Um, that's really good. Yeah, that's really good, that. Sugar, 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 sugar. The sugar. apple is tremendous. The apple flavouring. Yeah, it's really good, isn't it? It's really good. I mean, it's kind Seven of... grams of sugar. It's not... Her too. It's not like apple sauce mm -hmm. sort of flavour. Or like, as in the previous video, Mark sent us some uh, apple pudding. It's not kind of like... Um, proper apple flavour, but as a fake apple flavour, it's, it's delicious. Good, yeah. It's really delicious. I'm going to give that a nine. I give it a nine too. You too. Um, I like it because I, I feel like ours are really hard. Our worthers. Yeah, we, we don't. They're, we, they're not full. Ours are, ours are just worthers. They're not. Yeah, but they're like anything. solid. Like it takes ages to eat them. Yeah, because they're not filled with anything. They're just. So it's just. It's just hard a, caramel. a caramel, whatever you call well, it. Well, I like those that they you can eat it. Because I was thinking, yeah. oh, I've got to sit here and chew it for like 10 minutes on the video. Mm. But no, it's it's really good. Like, I like that. And I don't like caramel much, but those are really good. Yeah, no, they are really tasty. Yeah. This is, something is this that, our last thing in this one? Yep, yeah, this is something that Madam here is very, very excited about. That is. I've looked at She's been desperate to try these. Well, not, not these, but these. The and they are. <gasps> no, she wasn't excited about these. <laughs> Mark, how could you? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm so <laughs> upset. I thought it was pickles. She thought it was pickles. It's you told me it was pickles. <laughs> it's jalapenos. I love the lid though. How cute is yeah, that? Yeah, that's really good then. Oh, we actually have to eat one of those. Yeah, mate. We've got to try these. So this is original jalapeno. You've got to. <laughs> I will. I might cry. Right. Though. You know, Mark sent these a long way. Guilt trip me. Oh. Why is it jelly -ish? Oh, I don't know. It's like jelly. Oh, oh maybe I can't eat them. Oh, sad. <laughs> oh, that smells. Oh my god, no. Let me, let me. What, is it jelly or is it. Are there actually jalapenos Cane, in there? In cane sugar, vinegar, bell peppers, jalapenos, fruit, pecklin. Ah, oh, god, I can't eat it. That's the that's the uh, veggie alternative for the right. uh, Food colouring. Why would why would they need to food colour it? I don't know. But Funny. Let me just get a spoon. And and a glass of water. Okay. Yeah, I was expecting the original jalapeno. See, I was, preserves. It's a preserve. Cap it's jalapeno preserve. I so what so. do you eat it with? I don't know. Can you let us know in the comments what you would eat this with? I mean, presumably you don't just... You like put it on a burger or something, or what? I it might be, might be like, oh, it might be a relish for a dip. I mean, um... Oh, yeah, that would make chips. sense. Chips. Okay, you first. Okay. Oh, God, no. It's very, <gasps> very gluten. Why is it jelly like that? <laughs> oh, my God. Ew. The texture's... Oh, my God. The texture's hot. Is it hot? Is it hot? No. The texture's so weird. I'm I'm only taking this little bit or I might die. No, no, seriously. Oh my god. That is ace. That's actually really nice, but it is hot. But it it is nice, but it is hot. On a god, burger. On a burger, you know on on a a burger. burger, that would be so good. Oh um, that, that. It's sweet. It's beautiful. That is sweet. And it's peppery. Mm -hmm. and it's, it's peppery. It's just, I think it's one of the best relishes I've ever had in the, life. It has the tiniest kick of jalapenos. Yeah. But overall, it's like sweet and, and very peppery, like a pepper. That on a burger or with, just with chips or. Would be really good. Oh, with cheese. Oh, a cheese sandwich with that on. Oh, my oh no, God. mozzarella sticks. Mozzarella sticks. Dunk. That'd be really good. We got any mozzarella sticks in the house? Don't know. I digress. That we're hundred percent doing that. He's staying with me. Yeah, you can have it, but it is good. That is fantastic. Mm -hmm. I'm giving that a ten. Do you know what would happen if I took that home? Go on. It'd sit in the cupboard and not get used because it just would, even oh, though that, I like it. I can't believe with you it. that is in its rightful place. Oh yeah, that's gonna that. I mean seriously. I mean, <clears throat> I'm gonna hunt this down. It's so here. sweet. This is going to stay with me for life, this now, because I like it that much. In fact, I'm going to give it, give it 20 out of 10. Wow. Really, no, really. I, I mean, I love, I, just, I, I can't talk, I 
cannot speak. He's in love. You. He's I starstruck. Am, I'm in love. You're starstruck by the the chutney. Was it that chutney? I don't know what it relish. Relish. I, it's absolutely stunning. I can't even it describe it. It is a very it. you thing, I think. It I, is. I don't like um, spice, but to be fair, it's it is it has a kick, but it doesn't linger. So I can deal with that. That's good. Um, I would never have chose to buy that though. Well, this is why I like doing this because like I would never ever in a shop choose to buy that. Because we but didn't I've know tried it, it and yeah. I liked it. Well, we so. didn't know what it was, did we? Yeah. I mean, but I mean, if I saw that in the UK, you, I would you never. Wouldn't, you wouldn't know because no. you wouldn't know what that was. I didn't go down that aisle. Can, any of our English viewers, if you can find that, that is absolutely Amazon delicious. It, maybe. And I'm saying to you now that ditch mango chutney, mate. That with a poppadom. This is the future. That with a poppadom. Pop would oh. be good. Yeah, it would be good. Oh, that's that's true, right? That's really that's cool. Do you know what? we don't have anything we like don't. that? We really don't. That's like revolutionary, <laughs> isn't it? It is though. For us, it is. That we have nothing like that. Like it's so, it's genius. Why has no one in England done that? I've got no idea. That I can't stop looking at it. I think I'm going to marry it. <laughs> Poor Liz. I know. <laughs> That's crazy. And we really do not have anything like that, and I don't understand why, because the market for that would be huge. It would be huge. It would be huge. That yeah. would be a staple in my parents' house. Maybe we should start importing it. Maybe. Eh? Hey. 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 That might be a thing. Hey. I wonder if it's expensive. Let us know in the comments what that, on average, like, is that an expensive thing? Is it cheap? Like, yeah. I feel like in England that would be quite pricey. Um, the, don't you think? Because it's, it's, think it's like a luxury sort That of kind item. of thing, I think that's definitely sort of like Anything that comes something in jars. you'd find in Waitrose. Yes, definitely. You know what I mean? Anything that comes in jars like that and it's like, you know, it's a dip or it's a whatever. They're always expensive here. That's really cool. That's really good. I'm really pleased with that. Yeah. I mean, we discover a lot of things, but usually it's, it's like um, an alternative to something that we already know. Yeah. This is a completely new product. I mean, we've not try anything like this no we've got jars of jalapenos but they're in like watery stuff and brine and things like yeah. that yeah but we don't have that like, that's the texture is weird yeah and once you get over it though i'm like ah fine. well i think that's the yeah because it's the texture of jam in yeah, fact it's it the, texture the texture of, of very jam. thick jam yeah it is <laughs> yeah it's strange but Got marmalade it's it's like marmalade, marmalade. Yeah. yeah jalapeno marmalade yeah that's that is exactly what it is mm -hmm. it's jalapeno marmalade Delicious. Mind blown. Completely, completely. I'm, I'm sat here now. I'm not getting my words out because I'm thinking of what I can have for my lunch. You're literally that's staring gonna, at it. That's, that's going to go on because that is going to go on my lunch. Whatever I'm having, that is going on it. Mm. Yeah, pretty good. Right. So, with that in mind, mm -hmm. and with it being the last product in this particular section, and I want to go and eat it, we're off. <laughs> we're so, off. See you next time for another episode of Grubologist. So from me and Tash, that is Tarot.